dear friends if one has to encounter a ruthless senseless insensitive uncouth and a corrupt minded businessman you must not miss to meet shri pran shrinath hegde this pran shrinath hegde runs brick house restaurant on property belonging to dr manohar stephen joshua and has obtained trade license from the bangalore city corporation in the name of his wife hema malini pran hegde without producing rent agreement without obtaining noc from neighboring people moreover dr manohar stephen joshua property is a mulgeri property belonging to the ubmc trust association and therefore dr manohar stephen joshua cannot alienate and rent or lease out property to non protestant christians without prior approval of ubmc trust association now without approval of ubmc trust association dr manohar stephen joshua rented out his property in assessment number 140535 140537 and 140620 in which this great pran hegde has misused door number 1611621 bar 1 belonging to my mother oa sons who bestowed this property unto me on record this is a residential property come commercial building in front of the residence built on 1st of june 1992 with assessment number 460162 and 460163 and there are separate square feet for each construction now the crime is pran hegde knowing fully well that the property leased out to him by manohar stephen joshua contains only commercial license to run 448 square feet of business is running a 6000 square feet business in door number 1611621 bar 3 1611621 bar 4 which is licensed for residential apartment and beside having car park converted into a heated restaurant the restaurant is built on my compound wall touching it without any fire exit on october 2023 we have all seen how a cafeteria in koramangala burnt and caused a lot of damage the health department in mangalore has ignored these things and has given license to the wife of pran hegde to run breakhouse restaurant on a residential complex in a residential zone 
in a building which has only residential apartment license. Unfortunately, arrogant people like Pran Hegde have great lovers in Mangalore City Corporation. Few people who are lovers of money and no love for integrity, love for human lives, concern for other citizens of this country in living in Mangalore City Corporation Limited. I have taken legal action by directing my honorable advocate to issue Section 80 on the health officer and others and we have continued our efforts. Similarly, after these things, I am 